Hello my loves. Welcome back to my channel. It's me, April, the Red Lip Diva. And again, not wearing red lips because it has been a day, like a whole day. <sighs> yeah, a day. Um, I um, started out with being on the phone with my bank for an hour only to get like no resolution to what I was trying to do. Um, finally had to ask my dad for some help um, because let me tell you, when you go from a two income house to a one income house, even if it's just for a month, it's, it's rough. Um, and then we spent three, almost four hours at the VA today because the pharmacy can't get its head out of its behind um, when it comes to pain medication. Um, even though his doctor was supposed to have paved the way for us to pick up his pain medication today. Um, but apparently they didn't get the memo. Um, but anyway, we, that all kind of did better. Um, we, we got everything taken care of there. But by the time we left, I had not had anything to eat. Um, I hadn't taken my medicine. Uh, and I was so... I had such a bad headache that, like, everything, sounds and stuff just felt like razor blades being drug across my brain. Um, but, got home, and I have been waiting to do this all day. Um, my bestie wanted me to do it before I even left to go to the doctor's office this morning, um, or to the VA this morning, this afternoon. Um, but I was like, no, I need to go take a shower. I have some other stuff I need to do. It's going to have to wait till later. Um, and then when we got home, I was going to make, um, teriyaki chicken and a lo mein for dinner. And then I was going to do the, 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 the premise of this video. <sighs> but, um, other things happened and, um, we got something in the mail and my husband said, go to, you know, go to Walmart, whatever, um, go ahead and give me some snacks and this, that, and the other, and we picked up a couple other grocery things, we picked up dinner for tonight, um, but I didn't get home until after nine o'clock, <laughs> and then I was like, it is too late for me to cook, so I, and, and my, my head finally eased off, but while we were at, while me and my oldest were at Walmart, <laughs> Uh, it felt like there was somebody with a chisel and a hammer at my temple. And my head was hurting so bad that it was making my ear and my teeth and my jaw hurt. But thankfully, I carry, um, a pharmacy with me. So I was able to take something. Um, and by the time we got home, it had, like, settled down to a dull roar. Um, got everybody their food and um I ate like an entire plate of pizza rolls um I have some orange soda and I have the whole point of this video which is the Fab Fit Fun Summer Box look at how cute the box is it has little it has little ice cream bars on it little little, little popsicles on it it's so cute um, so yeah, I'm going to be unboxing the summer fab fit fun for you guys today. Um, my bestie has been pestering me to go ahead and do it because she has something in here that I got for her. <laughs> um, but she always loves when we open things and like, I love when she gets stuff in and when I, she loves when I get stuff in. So, um, the day started out pretty shitty, but it has ended up fairly nice. Um, things are kind of like settling down. It is... 11 o'clock at night um I had entertained the idea of maybe doing like a full face of makeup and then I said no <laughs> I got way too overstimulated today and I didn't take my anxiety medicine so my anxiety was kind of through the roof things are starting to calm down now so I feel like I can do a video without freaking out um so yeah I hope you guys are all doing good today 
Um, excuse me. I probably shouldn't drink soda in a video, but uh, there, there you go. Um, but yeah, was able to to pick up stuff for dinner tonight. Was able to pick up some stuff, quick stuff for lunches for everybody in the house. Was able to pick up some snacks for everybody in the house. Um, we we have a a whole shelf in my freezer that is dedicated to ice cream for different people. We have five people in the house, so there you go. Um, and I'm gonna go get into some of it when I'm when I'm done with this video. Um, but anyway, so that is what we're gonna do today. We're gonna open our summer fab fit fun now i am an annual subscriber so that means i get to fully customize my box if i want to and i do because i i generally like to know what i'm getting um in this particular subscription um however i only remember one thing that i chose and that's because it's for my bestie um, everything else is going to kind of be a surprise to me until I, <laughs> until I open it and look at it. Um, cause I legit do not remember what else I chose. Um, but yeah, so let's go ahead and pop this baby open. I'm going to use my, my stabby stab and go ahead and get this open. Yeah. All right, so here is the inside of the box. It is made um, out of 100% recycled craft materials. Um, and then inside you get a little sheet of stickers. I actually, um, I, I have kept these from the boxes that I've gotten the last year. Um, but these are so cute because you got like some little little cocktails and some fruits and a beach ball and some sunglasses those are super cute you always get um some kind of something off um pass it along to a friend who will love fat fit fun it's got a code on there you can get 15 dollars off your first fat fit fun box and then you get your little fat fit fun magazine um, now the magazine used to have, um, like everything in it, but now there's like a QR code that you scan and you can learn about all of your products. So there's the little magazine. Um, summer is here. It feels like summer is here. All right. And then you have your little packing material and then you always get like some some coupons there's actually a little sampler in here this time um okay so I got a coupon for daily harvest which is chef crafted food built on sustainably sourced fruits and veggies um, I got a coupon for Bright Sellers, which is like a wine discovery um, service. I got a liquid IV hydration multiplier sample, non-GMO electrolyte drink mix in the flavor guava. Um, I don't know if I will drink this because I'm not generally a fan of guava. But I'm sure somebody in the house will drink it. All right. So we're going to go ahead and just dig right on into here. The first thing I'm super excited about. So this is... Um, I can never remember how to pronounce this brand. Um, I think it's Way. Um, it's O-U-A-I. Way. Um, it's a scalp and body scrub. This freaking thing is huge and heavy. Like the the jar feels like it's glass, like frosted glass. Um, it does have a plastic seal, top lid thing. Um, oh, that smells amazing. 
that is very light. Um, and I like it. I can't wait. I love this brand. Um, and with it being summertime and, you know, my, my, my legs and my thighs gonna be out because I refuse, refuse to wear, wear pants in 80, 90, 100 degree weather in the South. Refuse. So yeah, plus it's a scalp scrub too, which you guys know me and my, my hair journey here lately. So I'm definitely going to be using this. All right. What else we got in here? It's a little one. Okay. So this is by Grace and Stella. It's the If Eyes Could Smile Eye Cream. Brightening and Moisturizing Eye Cream. Let me take it out of the package. See what it looks like. Ouch. If I seem a little bit a little bit off in this video, it's because um, whenever my sugar drops too low or when I get a really bad migraine, um, it's almost like I crash from it and have to kind of sort of bring myself back from it. Um, I was dropping words earlier, forgetting how to say things. Like this whole side of my face was just terrible. Um, but this is the packaging that it comes in. Super cute. Let me open it up. It also has a, like, seal lid thing. And there's the... It actually has no smell, which is awesome. This is like... Um, it sort of looks like it should be the consistency of peanut butter, but it's not. It's a, it's a cream. Um... I'm excited to try this. I love eye creams. I'm a little little obsessed with them. So yeah. Yeah, no scent. So this is the If Eyes Could Smile Grace and Stella Brightening Moisturizing Eye Cream. Throw these in the chalk. Alright. What's next in the books? Okay, so up next is the Kale Body Scrubber. This has one body scrubber in it. And this is actually a bonus item. This is not one that I chose. Um, this is this was a bonus item that they decided to um, give to everybody. But it's a, like a silicone scrubber, body scrubber. Um, yeah. So this was the bonus for this month, or this season. That's cool. I like it. I will definitely be using this. I like it. I like it. You can. Ooh, I don't like that sound. <laughs> yeah. I don't, I don't, but I do like playing with it though. It feels really cool. Um, I'm a very like tactile person. Um, so I, yeah. Uh, my train of, the, of thought is derailing. Um, so much today but yeah this was the bonus it's a body scrubber and it's silicone um this reminds me of like some fidget things i have a whole box of fidget toys by the way i kind of want to do a video on my fidget toys because i have amassed quite the co collection but anyway that that'll be it for a different time so yeah ko body scrubber what is next okay up next is the um, let's see. Up next is the Moro Moro um, leave hair leave-in conditioner, vegan, fair trade, biodiversity from the Amazon. Um, this was the this was the box that it came in. Um, and you guys, again, know me with my, the hair journey that I've been going through. Leave-in conditioner is a must. What else? Actually, let me see if this smells like anything. It is sealed. It does have a, it does have a, like a foil seal on it. It smells pretty good. It's very light. Like, it doesn't really smell like anything to me. It doesn't smell like, you know, coconut or vanilla or anything like that it just it smells very light and fresh and natural 
So yeah, I'm very excited. And that's a five ounce, five fluid ounce bottle. That thing is huge. Now I've never tried this brand before, um, but I like it. And I think it's Natura Ecos, um, Moro Moro. Yeah, it's by Natura, 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 Natura. I, I got nothing. All right, what's next in here? The thing that my bestie is waiting on is in the very bottom. <laughs> so we'll get to that in a minute. Um, next up is by Truly Clear. These are the Truly Gone Acne Fighting Super Dots. Um, there's 72 individual dots in here. There's 48 of the smaller 8 millimeter and 24 of the bigger 12 millimeter. Um, new invisible and easy peel design, natural and gentle protective formula. And it comes in a little resealable bag, so this is pretty cool. Um, I chose these because, one, there wasn't really much in that particular category that I wanted. But, two, these are amazing. Like, I love these little hydrocolloid acne patches. Um, not only do I use them, but my teenager, who is going to be 16 in July, his face is breaking out so bad. Um, and usually they're just tiny little bumps, like... But he'll get some really big ones. And they are so painful. So I usually just put one of something like this over over it. And within a couple of days it clears itself up and he he's good. So these will definitely, definitely get used in my house. Alright. Let me see. Okay, so this is the last item before we get to um, my bestie's gift. But this is... A mascara by Fenty Beauty by Rihanna. I love Rihanna. Um, and this is the actual first Fenty Beauty anything that I've ever owned. So I'm really excited. Um, this is the full frontal mascara, volume lift, and curl. Let me get it out of the box. So here's the packaging. And then let's take a look at... Oh, I like the brush. It's a big fluffy brush. So I'm gonna. I don't pay no attention to my dark circles and my blemishes. I haven't done my skincare for tonight yet. Okay, so I am definitely getting links. I am definitely getting links and some volume too. I can't wait to kind of test drive this at a later time, but I'm excited to use this. This is my very first Fenty product and I'm excited. Put my glasses back on so I can see stuff. Okay. So yeah, um, kind of a, Recap, the Fenty Beauty Mascara, the Truly Clear Acne Patches, the Natura Ecos Muromuro Leave-In Conditioner, the Grace and Stella If Eyes Could Smile Eye Cream, the Way Scalp and Body Scrub, and then the bonus was the Silicone Body Scrubber from K.O. All right, so last, but certainly not least, is something that has been anxiously awaited all day today. Um, this is something that I chose for my best friend. Um, she loves this color, and it was really the only thing in the category that it was this was offered in. Um, the other stuff I didn't see myself using, but I knew that she would love this. So, this is the Samara, um, like, crossbody bag, and it's in this beautiful, like, pale pink color, dusty pink color. Um, it does have, like, gold accents, but it's super cute, and it's, like, um, like, 
velvety inside almost. Um, it's just like a one little, um, it doesn't have any pockets or anything fancy or anything like that, but it does, this is the, the closure. Just a little, see, ta-da. Let me take, and it does have a crossbody strap that is adjustable. And it also has the little gold button snaps. So it is adjustable. It is like you can take it apart so it's not. I, I am struggling today. So yeah, this is the Samara crossbody bag. And she is standing over here like anxiously awaiting her new bag. For for a girl that uh, doesn't really do purses, uh, she does makeup on occasion, but nothing like I do. Uh, this girl is excited about some mother freaking bags. Like, I, I do not understand. But as long as she gets some use out of it, I don't care. So, yeah. Here we go. Are you ready? There you go. Thank you. <laughs> She's so excited. She's over here like. <laughs> um, I'm so glad that I was able to get that for her. And see, that's one of the things that I love about being able to choose. Um, from, oh, that looks so good on you. And it fits you really well, too. She's over here modeling it for me. <laughs> and like dancing. Um, but. If there's not something that I necessarily like in the categories, I know that at some point, um, I know that there's going to be something that she's going to enjoy. Um, let's see. So there is some stuff in here that tells you like some of the stuff that you received. Um, so we've got transform your lashes. Let's see. Oh, it just talks about like a technique that you can try with that. And then, um, it talks about your pimple patches. I'm just kind of looking through this like magazine. Um, I wish I could tell you guys, like, the prices of everything. Oh, it does have some recipes in here. That looks really good. So, there's a recipe. It's that Taste the Tropics. So, there's a recipe in here for oven-baked coconut shrimp. I freaking love coconut shrimp. So, I may end up having to, like, try that. Um, there's a coconut bacon, which I am, I'm, I, yeah, no. Leave my bacon alone. Um, and then there are... Magic Cali bars. They're like cookie bars. And then it just talks about like some women making waves. Um, like a spotlight. And then there's a page on uh, care. Um, which is helping women and families in the Ukraine. You've got... Um, a work, little workout routine in here because one of the things that you could get was the New Balance ab wheel. I don't get in the floor unless I absolutely don't have no choice. So I wasn't going to use that. Um, but it does give you like a little workout in here for that. And then like you have a little tracker page in here. It says, uh, they say that it takes 21 days to form a new habit and 66 consecutive days for new behavior to become an automatic part of your routine. As you try new things and set new goals, use this monthly habit tracker to watch your progress. So they've got to drink water and then they've got exercise and then there's three more lines for you to be able to track that for the next 31 days. And then it has one of my favorite things, which is the Zodiac signs. Um, I am a Gemini, a very proud Gemini. It is officially Gemini season. I'm very excited. Um, but let's see what this has to say about my zodiac signs. It says the hobby you should try based on your zodiac sign. Um, 
Geminis always have an awesome story to share and an eclectic variety of somewhat odd hobbies. Combine your love for expression and connection by getting your art supplies out and collaging some postcards. Send your handmade works out to pen pals and make someone's day. So I don't really have any pen pals, but actually that sounds like a really cute idea. Um, so yeah, <coughs> excuse me, my word. And then there are some exclusive offers to some of the brands that were represented. So we've got First Aid Beauty, Way, um, IGK, Fenty Beauty, Tula Skin Care, Soar, um, Cosmetics, Anastasia Beverly Hills. I wanted to get an ABH lipstick, but they didn't have the color that I wanted. They only offered two shades. And the first one, I don't really wear nudes. It feels like it washes me out. But they had like a really pretty pinky nude color. But of course, that one was completely sold out. Um, poolside and then uh, Foxy Bay. So, yeah. If I wasn't using my phone to record this, I would go in and see, like, how much all of this stuff was worth. <clears throat> but it's, I definitely get my, mm, sorry, I definitely get my money's worth every season. So, because it works out to be about, it's like $50 a season. Now, you do get a little bit of discount if you choose a, like, yearly membership. Um... But I've been pretty happy so far. I will definitely get use out of every single one of these items. I will use every one of them. Um, which is one of the reasons why I love being able to pick, like, customize. Because that means I'm going to use the items. Um, or somebody I know is going to absolutely use the items. Like that purse. I, I'm not going to be able to wear that. I There's a reason my mama used to call me her little linebacker. I am very broad. Very broad-shouldered. I have a large chest, like, even on its longest length, I wouldn't have been able to wear that as a crossbody bag. Not to mention, it's not big enough for all my shit. I told you, I, I'm prepared for everything in my purse. I have a pharmacy in there. I have, like, fidgets. I have all kind of stuff in there. I think the only thing I don't have is makeup. Uh. I have lots of lip glosses or lip, lip balms though. But anyway, so that was my summer 2022 FabFitFun box. I am very excited to try everything. I'm very happy with everything that I got. Um, my best friend is over here putting stuff in her new bag as we speak. I'm so glad she's enjoying it already. Um, and it's the perfect like hue for this time of year. So, she'll use that for a little while before switching to something else, <laughs> which I can't say anything. Um, I switch my bag out several times a year, so just depends on what I'm feeling. Um, anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know that it wasn't as, like, upbeat and kind of knowledgeable as my other videos are. Um, but like I said, I had a really rough day today. Um... And I don't think me nor my bestie could wait till tomorrow for me to open the box. I, I definitely wanted to get everything, break everything out of here. Um, so, I do apologize if this is not this wasn't as, you know, um, as maybe good as my other videos. But I always want to be real with you guys and show you guys all of the aspects of my life. So, I hope you guys enjoyed anyway. And um, the next thing I should be posting. So as far as unboxings go, the next one will be the June 2022 single swag. Um, I won't get another fact of fun until fall. Um, and then I'll have, hopefully have a favorites video for you guys. Um, probably in June. And then, um, I'm thinking about doing a, like, video of my fidget collection I just got some new ones so like I'm excited um and then I got just got some new crystal towers as well that I kind of want to show off so um be on the lookout for those I'm hoping to be able to um do a couple different little videos here and there other than just unboxings and things like that so I will keep you guys posted thank you so much for joining me I hope you guys have a great rest of your day.
and a great evening. And I will see you guys in the next video.